Good day, viewers, wherever you're watching from. I am Amutai Odeni to Ordinance. I have something very important to tell you, just very briefly. If you've not subscribed to our channel, don't take any stress to just click on the subscribe <laughs> button. <laughs> you can see I'm um, before the camera. Oh, the camera is behind. Um... <laughs> so, why are you laughing? <laughs> You mean some people have not subscribed to this channel? <laughs> yes, that is why we are asking them to subscribe. <laughs> they are missing out a lot. <laughs> so viewers, please subscribe <laughs> to this channel and press the notification bell. <laughs> press the notification bell as well so you can receive notifications when we upload any video. Thank you. Anxiety is really setting on yeah. you. I mean, the wedding is in three weeks. You need to look good. You need to look fresh. Come on. Yeah. Stop stressing. Relax, girl. We got this. We got you. I just don't understand why everybody says, I look this way, I look that way. I don't understand. And who's everybody? Because yeah. so you, you, you look stressed. How are you, baby? Jeez. How are you? <laughs> How are you? How are you? How How are you? Okay, no problem. Let me see my friends right. out. So bye. Bye bye. bye. You ladies, thank you so much for coming to see 
So how are you, Richard? Uh, Richard. Hey, to me. What are you wow. looking at? I've been greeting you for how many times now? To me, your friends. Mm. I mean, are they still single? <laughs> I mean, you can help a brother. I out. know that there's nothing else you'll talk besides that. My friends are looking for a serious man, somebody that's going to take them serious. And you, I know you. You know me. Okay, let me ask you one question. Mm -hmm. When do you see yourself entering a jewelry shop to buy a ring for a uh, woman? Exactly. I think we'll talk about it when you get an answer. To Charles. Me. That's true. It's, it's, it's just true. Don't afford to keep running after ladies. I mean... You have to make a decision. Exactly. How are you doing? He, he just jumped into the car when he heard I was going out. He didn't even know when I was going to. Mm, because I was surprised when you when you came with him. I, I On the phone you said you were alone, so... I was just... You need to change. You need to be born again again. How can a fully man, a fully grown man like me be born again? Should I crawl back into my mother's womb? You're always joking. <laughs> Baby, how are you doing? Wow. I... This your face is not, is not attractive at all. Hmm. What's the problem? I don't know what. Charles, borrow me those keys. I just want to get something out. I'll be right back. Okay. Make sure you lock the back doors very well. Baby. What's wrong? What's the matter? No, I'm just, I think I'm just feeling weak of recent. I don't know what's the problem, but I'm just really feeling so weak. And this is the third time you've been, you've been complaining of this weakness of a day. Mm. Don't you think you need to see a doctor? You know, the wedding is just in three weeks. You can't afford to break down in wedding or break down in honeymoon. Honeymoon now turns to honeysome. No, you have to see a doctor. I, I don't like the way you're, Honey, you're looking. I don't. I believe that I'm fine. I think it's just the preparation and the movement that goes with it. Or I don't even like hospitals and you know it. Why are you even suggesting that I should go to the hospital? You know very well I don't like hospitals. And that is one of the reasons I've been avoiding this. Can we not have this conversation? Nobody likes hospitals. But you just have to go. You really? Okay, fine. I think you've been stressing yourself. Man. You've been stressing yourself. We have just two event planners. Mm -hmm. We can get two more. Uh -uh. Yes, we can get two more. Has it got to that? Ah, it has passed that. Look at how you're looking. You've grown lean in just a week. So we'll try to make arrangements getting two event planners in addition to those ones we okay, have. Okay, no problem. It's fine. If it will make you happy, then I'll go see a doctor. Seriously? Yes, I will. But that's why I love you. Because eh? I want to see that smile. That's why. Exactly. Eh? Don't make me feel agitated again. Don't be angry. No, anytime I see you stress, no, I'm not I'm not happy. I stress too. I stress from inside out. Eh? Stop. Ah, that's nice. <laughs> you must see a doctor tomorrow. Yeah, no problem. So after that we can we can get more event planners. Okay. We can get like two or three more. Okay. Don't stress yourself. Alright, no problem. Deal. Deal. Uh uh. This one we are dabbing. Uh -uh. Hey. This so, is what do you have for, for me? That's what I was trying to ah, go and prepare for you and your friend. I prepared your favorite when you told me you were coming. I was like, ah, this marriage, I must keep it. You are a darling. I prepared a uh, soft Gary for you. Gary. Mm, Gary. Oh. I want that ah. Gary now. I'll leave in a peanut so that you, you told me you were very hungry, yeah. so I added peanuts. Is that what you'll be giving me in marriage now? Ah. I bet you can take Gary. Gary? Gari, Gari, Gali. I'm sure, I'm sure I'll enjoy it. Do you like it? I like it. Mm -hmm. My sister brings some galitos. Oh, that's and why I like it. One of those angels that just walked out. <laughs> the one on the left. You will never change, Richard. Come on, <laughs> sister. You have to change. I change in my way, bro. Angel on the left and right. Ah, come on. You still see center up and down. You're getting married <laughs> next to you, brother. So we are waiting for you. Just bring Gary. I'm just, bringing, you I'm can bringing. use that as appetizer before we go. Okay, Ali. I love Galitos. It's not Galitos, it's Gary. Gary. If, if she brings it to you, you understand what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. Everything she cooks <laughs> is perfect.
for my husband. Oh, he's just calling. Okay, me. my regards to him. All right. You know, I don't think this will affect your love. You just need to talk to your fiance, discuss with him about um, the possible options that you both have. I really, really believe there's going to be a way out of this. Okay, and you are not the first person in this condition. <laughs> Though I know it's a very critical situation for the both of you, but I just need you to believe that God is in control and I need you to believe him and to trust him and his directions, okay? Okay. Um, anyway, don't forget to get the drugs um, at the pharmacy. Uh, it's just flu symptoms, but stress induced, so you need to take a lot of rest, okay? And don't forget to also take much, or let me say, a um, lot of fruits and fluids too, but the rest is very important. I'll be waiting to hear from you. But please don't be disturbed. Do not be disturbed. Alright. Take care. Hello, baby. How are you doing? What's the matter? Have you been to the hospital? What did the doctor say? Ah, okay, okay, um... Okay. I'm at work now. When I leave work, I'm going to go home. They're from home. I'll, I'll come to your place. Yes, yes, yes. But then just try to highlight, highlight me. What, what happened? Okay, I'll, I'll be with you shortly. Like, doctor say? Did you do any test? <laughs> I told you, you just need to have some rest. Hmm? You just need to, you've been stressing yourself lately. You just need to have some rest. This status from your mom. I'm not just relying on our report. I, 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 just, I believe my mom when she told me I was AA when I was five years old. And ever since then, I just got the mentality. Oh, I was so careless. <laughs> I can assure you. If you had known this from the beginning of this journey, we would have gone this far. That's why I was asking you to confront this because I knew I was hey hairs. Why would you say you were hey hey? No, I, I know in South Africa you have a very low incidence of the sickle cell disease. That was why I didn't even want. I, irrespective of that, you should have actually confirmed these. Ha. Huh. Okay, honey, I understand. But I have some options that Dr. Peace discussed with me. She said we can go through with the marriage and abort any pregnancy that we discover as as as. I, I think it's a good I think it's a good option. Abortion. Uh no. 
No, in our family, we don't do abortion. In, fact, in both nuclear and extended family, we don't do abortion. From my father's side and mother's side, we don't keep people. So that one's not an option. Uh, no, we abortion can. No, we can't do abortion. Okay. There are other options that she discussed with me. She, she told me about a pre-implantation genetic something like that where she talked about the embryos being screened and only the ones that are free of the SS genotype would be transferred according to this procedure. You can't tell me that's also not a good option. We must at least choose one of these options if we really want to get through with this marriage. This is just English and then apart from that Seth, it looks like something that's going to be so expensive. Ah. this risk. But faith is all about taking risks. Not a risk that can be avoided. Listen baby, for seeing a disaster and choosing to allow it to happen, to me it could not see responsibility. This is just a common sense decision and God honors common sense. I just, I just believe in miracles. Okay, I was, let's, let me show you something. I was reading something and I like came across this. It's by the World Health Organization. They were speaking, because I had to research, I had to find out more about this. And they are telling me that the average life expectancy a sickle cell anemia patient in the United States has increased from below 20 years to about 63 years. Let's, let's sit down, let's I'm, I'm not angry. Okay. <laughs> I'm, not, okay. I'm not angry. I look like I'm angry. Listen, I want you to understand so you can be able to, to understand why um, I feel like this is not, this shouldn't shouldn't be a big deal. This, Listen to what they're saying about Nigeria. They said the average life expectancy of the average person in Nigeria is 50 years. And I also didn't bother to check the one in South Africa because you told me we are going to move to Nigeria, then the United States. So if you move to Nigeria or wherever United States, so automatically AS will change to A. Love conquers all. What is love conquering here? No, no, what is what don't you are putting love, you are just missing love and then it's, 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 listen, you know what? You know Nigeria is the country with the highest number of sickle cell patients. Just because we are fighting it. See, there's a story that you don't know, ne? You know, I have two other siblings. Mm -hmm. we, were we were originally five. Mm. My parents were heirs, heirs, heirs. They fitted it too. They got married to themselves and then they gave birth to five of us. Okay. Three heirs, I'm the heirs, and then one he -he. Out of the three heirs, two have gone. See, I, I know the stress that goes, I mean, in the family. I know the stress we've been... You were talking about Nigeria and the... What, what do you call it? 50-50? Even if, if somebody dies at 50 years, is it a, a good age to die? And do you know the stress till that age? See, this thing is... I, I cannot... I, I can fit a lot of things. So. But this one... Uh, I cannot fit this. So this... Uh, I... Mm. Honey, I don't... I'm sorry, I don't, I don't think I understand what you, I, wait, do, I don't, uh, are we ending it here? Is I'm that not, what you're saying, I'm that not, we're ending I'm it here? I'm not saying we're ending it, but there's, there's just no way, but I'm not saying we're ending it though, I didn't say that, but there's, <laughs> there's no way, what are you, you know, saying, I, then? I, I love you, I love you, but, Eh, I cannot risk this. If you love me, then we can work it out. Um, I suggested later we can go see past, uh, Dr. Peace. So he can give us more options so we can know what... You can't tell what, me this what, is the only what option. Magic, what magic is uh, Dr. Peace? Uh, what are you calling uh, uh, Dr. Peace is going to... We should change uh, AS to A. Uh, well, see... Ah. Ah, this is AS, oh. Ah. 
I think I have to I have to go now. I will I would I will call you in the evening. I remember I'm later in the night when when I when I get home. Uh, I, I love you, eh? I love you. I I love you, but then uh I'll... You're breaking my heart. Eh? Is that what you're doing? I, I'm not I'm not breaking your heart. I'm not I'm not I will I will see you. <laughs> eh? I love you, eh? I will see you. Don't no, don't cry, don't cry too much. Don't 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 cry. I I will see you. so much I don't want you guys to go through what I'm going through I just have one question for you do you know your genotype our genotype please go to the hospital and check please
my name is uh, Salem. Okay. And this is my brother. No. Oh, okay, nice to meet I'm you. I've been seeing you every Sunday, and I guess this is the second Sunday. Yes, actually, I've been here. I've been in the neighborhood for three weeks now, and I've actually been looking for a living faith church that I can attend until I came across your own. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're Thank welcome. you. That's good of you. It's actually, a very nice place, actually. Yeah, yeah. it is. Mm -hmm. Actually, we are the church full of tea. Yeah. Okay. So we have decided to get your number so that we'll give you to our church team uh, leader. Yeah, team leader. Oh, team leader. Yeah. again? Because I actually gave him, I met with him. Yeah, I met with him last week. Oh. And I gave him my number. He has it. That could be true. That could be true. Mm -hmm. That's why Pastor said I should get her number. Yes. Okay, so it's it's Pastor who said I should get your number. Oh, so, so that we can add you to the church uh, WhatsApp. WhatsApp group. Oh, yeah. Pastor. Yeah. So you can just give it to us. Uh, you okay. could just call no problem. Name, no problem. Okay. Before I give you my number, okay. I have just one question to ask. Oh, no, no problem. Sure. And I'm going to need you to be honest. Definitely. <laughs> I'm, I'm, Our names are honest. I'm what are honest. your genotypes? She did not say Jonathan. She said Jonathan. You don't even know it. She's the one who talked about it. Now you are trying to watch it. It's Jonathan that you should talk about. Jonathan. Jonathan. I don't know. My other name is like this AS. Oh. You think you are sick? Hmm? You think you are sick? For me, I don't know. Though. If you only say yes, you are half sick. Uh, are you, you are full sick? Okay, this kit you just saw now, it speaks majorly about hemoglobin genotype. Nigeria is the country with the highest burden for sickle cell disorder. Can you imagine that? Every year, 150,000 children or babies are being born in our country. And out of these 150,000 children that are being born, 100,000 of these children, they do not live to see their 50th birthday. Why? Because they have sickle cell disorder. And we continue to say we are fitting it, we are fitting it. You know your status to be AS, and you know that of your spouse to be AS, and yet you just want to go ahead and get married. You should not do that. If you know you are AS, or you have AC, or AD, it is better you don't get married to somebody who is also a similar status like that. Because there is a greater chance of you giving birth to children who are sickle cell. And these children will suffer. You can't imagine the crisis they go through every day. So this is a very short message for you. If you do not know your hemoglobin genotype, make sure you make an appointment with a doctor today and know your genotype. Thank you. Let me show you something. When I was reading across, I came across... Guys, do you know it's not easy to cry? Camera rolling. Guys, camera rolling. Guys, you heard. This guy is shaking at me. You are not serious about marriage. Uh, uh, Charles, come on. Liv Charles, you know me. let me ask you one question. Yes. When do you see yourself entering a jewelry shop to buy a ring? Uh, exactly, we'll talk about it when you have an answer for me. But you need to born hmm. again, to be hmm. born again. Exactly. How can serious a fully, prayers. How can a fully grown man like me be born again? Hmm. Should I enter back into my mother's womb? <laughs> I'm not serious. <laughs> No, when we were coming, I was coming to see you when you just jumped into the car. Mm. Mm.